Hey, what's going on, y'all? It's Jay the Asian Weird. Bro, I is tired. <laughs> but I can't even complain. Like, it's really gone to a point where some of it is the 9 to 5, and the other part is just me getting my shit. Like, doing what I love, you know, working my passion. You know, I'm, I'm not actually at the point now where I don't want to keep saying hustling. Because I'm not out here just trying to nickel and dime. You know what I mean? I'm not out here just trying to make a buck here, a buck there. I'm really just trying to make some major fucking moves. So, I'm out here living in my purpose. I'm working my shit. Alright? So, just came back from a great fucking session. You know, um, coming around some great motherfucking people, awesome fucking energy. And I'm realizing, like, there's some times where we could be in this headspace of. We know what we want from ourselves, right? But then we can be either really too hard on ourselves or be in our head to where we're like pussyfooting before we actually make a move. But then there's a lot of people out there that's like rooting for us harder than we root for ourselves, which is fucking crazy. Because for me, I'd be surprised to this day. I'd be surprised when people hit me up and be like, yo, like, I was hoping to hear from you or to see you. I ain't seen you in a minute. And I'm like, I just be excited just to even hear that shit. And it don't have to be from, like, a, a, a lot of people. Like, for me, just hearing it from one or two people make, means a lot to me. Because that means that I'm impacted. You know, over time, of course, you're trying to grow a business, trying to grow an empire. Yeah, having those numbers be on the magnitude amount is, of course, makes a difference. But it starts with one. It starts with two. You know, so when you have people who are really watching what you're doing and they rooting for you, a lot of times that's what we need to keep to keep moving, to be motivated, to to really just keep doing the damn thing and not second guess ourselves. Vehicle stopped on shoulder ahead. And that's what I'm seeing right now. You know what I mean? And keep in mind, I've already been getting in a better place with believing in me. And everything that I'm doing, and even though shit might shift differently from how I might expect it to be, but at the end of the day, the end result is going to be me living my dream the way that I want it to be. So it just has sometimes you have detours, and that's okay. And I'm becoming okay with that shit. So I'm not in this place of now being gun ho about I need to do this this certain type of way. I need to meet this certain type of person. I can't deviate from the plan. Fuck all that. This is part of the plan now. This is literally a part of what this big grand scheme of things that I'm trying to do. You know, that person that you didn't expect to meet could be the key to what you're trying to get to. You just never fucking know. And it'd be the people that you least expected. That's going to be the ones rooting for you. That's, that's pushing you, you know what I mean, to be successful. That's telling you, like, bro, like, quit doing what the fuck you're doing as far as this, whatever the nine to five that's not making you happy. And, and live your dream. Like, I got faith that you can really fucking do this shit. And that's where I'm at. And that's what I'm seeing for y'all as well. Like, if you are in a place where your goddamn daily alarm kicked in, it tells me I'm doing great and I need to celebrate my wins for the day. I forgot that shit was set. But, um, like, I want, I want that same shit for y'all. Like, I want y'all to be great. I want y'all to be pushing. I want y'all to be in this headspace of, you know what I mean? Uh, like, it's more than just you. At the end of the day, no matter what you're doing, I know it's us individually that's putting out the work. You know what I mean? But at the end of the day, it, it really has to do with more than just you. If you have kids, it got to do with your kids. If you got a partner, it has to do with your partner. Everything that you're doing at this point is affecting everybody else that comes in contact with you. Especially if it's on a daily. You know what I mean? So you can't be out here just thinking like, what the hell you doing don't matter. Because it matters. It matters so much. That it literally, it can define how your life and somebody else's life is going to be. So, this is why it's not to put this unnecessary pressure on you, but to let you know that whatever the fuck you're doing, whoever the hell you are, it is going to make a difference. You are making a difference right now. I don't care how small it is. I don't give a fuck if it's just a TikTok video. I don't care if it's anything any fucking thing but because of the fact that you put your heart and your soul down on that thing whatever platform whatever device it's making a difference and that's 
what I am seeing and that's what I am embracing that's what I feel you know and it resonates bro it resonates with everybody that that comes in contact with you so for me I'm definitely not going to ever be in that place again to where I'm second guessing myself I'm gonna tell you that right now because when I look back at a lot of shit that I've done I'll be like yo I <laughs> it's amazing you know what I mean? Because I don't plan a lot of my shit. I really don't. Like, I don't plan a lot of my shit. Like, I plan, like, things that I want to do and the goals. And I'll have, like, ideas of what it is that I'm trying to get. And then somehow, Law of Attraction will bring those things to me. You know what I mean? So, there's that. So, I'm just like, all right. You know, I can, I can handle that. And now, it's like me allowing those things to come to me. You know? And being okay with that. And not being in this place of, I can't accept it because it's not on my... On my itinerary. My itinerary is going to change. And I'm okay with that. Because at the end of the day, that shit is working for me and my benefit. You know what I mean? So, I'm loving everything that's happening right now. Like, I'm really about to go to, go home, get in the bed, <laughs> give me like a nap. So, I can go back to work overnight. And then I got a full day tomorrow. And the rest of the day that's happening tomorrow, I ain't got shit to do by 9 to 5. I love that shit. Like, the fact that I'm doing... Those things that I love now in my life, I wouldn't trade this shit for the world, bro. So, it's just a matter of time now. The 9 to 5 is going to be eradicated completely. And it's just going to be me doing my shit, taking care of my family. Shit. And the way my girl moves, we we both of us going to be our own million dollar, millionaire bracket. Enjoy the journey is all I got to say. Enjoy that journey. Don't shun away from the opportunities that you're asking for, by the way. When these things come to you, it's because you're asking for them. Because you already put something out in the universe that's saying that you want this. And they're going to give you things that's going to make that's gonna make those things happen. And, and you're not going to expect that shit. Alright? So, I love y'all, bro. I hope y'all have a great night. I hope y'all have a great weekend. Y'all probably going to see me again before this weekend's out. I'm definitely sure y'all going to see me again before this weekend's out. So, catch y'all on the next one, alright?